There's something scary about the world we live in today. And the more and more people I see on social media, the more and more guys I interact with, there seems to also be this attitude against what is going on that you'll deal with it later, or it's just normal, it's part of the aging process. But there are signs that testosterone levels are getting lower than ever. With the environment that we live in, with the day-to-day -day stresses you have being an entrepreneur in your job. And yes, after 30, your testosterone levels do decrease. Around 1% every year, 10% every decade. But that's not to say you can't do anything to help that. The problem is that a lot of people are decreasing a hell of a lot more than 1%. A hell of a lot more. They show signs of low testosterone when they have high fatigue and low energy. They show signs of depression. Have a lot of mood swings and irritability. Their strength levels get lower. Their muffin tops seem to overflow and their body fat levels go up. But it simply gets ignored because that's life. That's how we get when we age. I can't deal with it. I haven't got the time. I'm such a busy guy. Here's a reality check. You're not a busy guy. If you get your health in check, you're going to have more time in the future. You're going to get more done in one day. You're going to have less brain fog. You're going to have more energy. And you're going to feel a lot more vitality as a result. Here are some things you can do in order to increase your testosterone. Drop that body fat, increase your bottom line, decrease your waistline. The first thing is to lift weights. Simple, right? But you haven't got time. In fact, a lot of my clients, when we start, will have body weight workouts. That's cool. We can increase the intensity in these body weight workouts and make sure you are getting some testosterone boosting results. They could be 10 minutes, 15 minutes. In fact, you could get a kettlebell and do some weight training. Get some compound movements in there. Even go into the gym if it's nearby. We can get you doing a good, decent workout which will boost your testosterone in 20, 25 minutes maximum. We can easily make time for that. Number two is to increase your dietary fat and cholesterol levels. Get some good fats in there. Get some good nuts, some good oils, some avocados, some eggs. Get these things in there which cholesterol, it got a bad rep, but it is essentially nature's steroid. And it's good for cognitive function as well as being the precursor to pretty much so many different hormones in the body. We need to have it in our diet. Number three is get your good levels of vitamin D, magnesium, and zinc. These minerals, these nutrients, they are things which help your body create testosterone. Increase that testosterone, you're gonna lower your body fat levels to a degree. Number four is a lot of people, especially in this busy entrepreneurial hustle grind mode, seem to slack on this, sleep. Getting good sleep is going to keep your body's cortisol levels in check by helping your body recover. Helping your body get this solid, deep testosterone boosting time. Increasing your growth hormone levels. And cortisol actually blocks the body's ability to use testosterone. So the more stressed we are every single day of our life, the less ability we have to use the testosterone that we aren't even creating anyway. Fighting fire with fire there. And number five is to decrease your processed sugar levels. If you have a high sugar diet, potentially, if it's high calories as well, you're going to be putting on weight. You're going to be putting on fat. These have been linked to lower testosterone. And there's studies that say having high sugar meals a couple of hours later have again shown very low testosterone within studies. So it's up to you really. Do you want to just really BS yourself into thinking that your testosterone is getting low just because of your age? Do you want to keep saying you've not got time to deal with it until it really hits the fan and you have to do something about it when your body has suffered some changes that you may not even be able to reverse? 
Do you want to get things in check? Use those five points that I've said there. Go lift some weights, increase your fat and cholesterol intake, vitamin D, magnesium and zinc, get your sleep in check, and don't have too many processed sugars. If you need help with this, you need accountability, you need to get your health optimization in check, give me a shout. We can design a plan specific for you. Either drop a comment, hit up ollie at revitalizationblueprint.com, go to the website, click contact me, or just get in touch any way you see you need to. We'll book in a revitalization call and we can go through the things we need to check to make sure your health is optimized.